Welcome back, YouTubers and friends. Spongy here once again, and we have another new installment of Cooking with Spongy. Uh, today we are going to be cooking up my favorite, most definitely my favorite, some sterling silver rib grilling steaks from Sobeys. I scooped these up for a magnificent price, two for $10.91. Like you can't beat that. There's no way you're going to find steaks that cheap. Uh, they're on sale because of the date that they're cut on, I'm sure. But if you put these in the freezer, they're good for like at least a month or two anyways, easily. So I'm going to cook these up tonight for you guys. Uh, show you how I like my steaks cooked. Also going to do, once again, some red potatoes. The baby potatoes. I got a portobello mushroom, not a magic mushroom. <laughs> Gonna chop up one onion and half a green uh, bell pepper. And also to go with it, the compliments Caesar salad kit. I like the Caesar salad, so we're gonna go with that. Anyways, uh, also got some uh, Windsor sea salt to go with the uh, baby potatoes and the so uh, anyways stay tuned and uh, with once again the magic of computers presto changeo you're gonna see everything all chopped up and ready to go on the barbecue so I got my onions all chopped up and uh, I just spread a little bit of butter or margarine on the tin foil so it doesn't stick and I'm going to place some of the portobello mushroom in amongst the onions. Like so. Now I got my green pepper chopped up and placed in there as well. Make sure you rinse off your vegetables too before you cook them because you never know. Always good to play it safe. Alright folks, all the preparations are done. I just got the potatoes all chopped up there and uh, I'll give you a little visual here in a second. And there you are folks, the uh, potatoes are all chopped up, a little bit of sea salt sprinkled over them. Be good to go here momentarily. Fire up the barbecue. I wrap my uh, vegetables just like I wrap my Christmas present. Horrible. But anyways, it does the trick so stay tuned and we'll be out on the deck all right, here folks, momentarily. Alright folks, the veggies have been on the barbecue for about a good 25 minutes now. I gave them a flip, so without uh, any further ado, the prime rib is going on the queue. And here's a little view of the veggies, folks. Coming along nicely. Steak to go on very shortly. All right, folks, the steak has landed. Momentarily, this puppy will be ready to eat. And my sauce of choice tonight, folks, is uh, Diana chicken and rib. You can't go wrong with the chicken rib. It's to die for. It's awesome. Gives that nice sweet taste. So, yeah, I use the chicken and rib pretty well faithfully on all my uh, chicken, back ribs, steaks. So, uh, stay tuned and you're about to see this succulent prime rib. Alright folks, um, I do my steaks seven minutes aside and with any luck. It's been over a year since I barbecued, but it's kind of like riding a bike. You never forget. Looks pretty good to me. Smells good too. Better flip the veggies. So, Mars, uh, Shelly and Graham. I know you guys haven't been barbecuing for a while, hopefully sooner or later, you guys will be. Uh, this barbecue's for you. I'll enjoy every bite. Maybe I'll save you one. Anyways, check out this cat. Isn't he something? Say hello to the YouTuber, Snuffy. Say hello. Say, say hello. Who are they? Where are they? Yeah, that's Snuffy. 
maybe he's my new mascot. It kind of matches my apron, black and white. But anyways, he enjoys chasing his tail. <laughs> anyways, hope you guys enjoy this cooking video. Well, I'd like to take the time to thanks for everybody that has been subscribing as of late. Uh, I'm at 97, three more and I'll be at 100. The 100th subscriber, um, it's gonna mean a lot to me, just as much as every other one. Um, the 100th video, it's gonna be a special video, so hope you guys stay tuned for that. Anyways, uh, hope you guys really enjoy my cooking videos. It also, uh, restaurant reviews and uh, cruising with Spongy. That's going to be my new uh, videos soon. Uh, so, yeah. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Hit that like button. Comment down below. And hope you guys had a wonderful May 2 4 weekend. Here we go, folks. The last flip. Ta da. Can you smell it? I sure can smell it. Tastes good already. I can just smell it, taste it. Mm -mm -mm. Spread some of that goodness all over her. And in another couple more minutes, she's going to be ready. Here we go, folks. The prime rib, roasted potato, and the Caesar la salad. Look at that. You'd think I took it forever making this. Alright folks, about to tell you how some of this tastes. We'll go with the uh, veggies first. Mm -hmm. The portobello, really good. Roasted red potato, really delicious with that little touch of sea salt. I know how salad tastes, so I'm not even going to bother giving you a description on that. But here's the prime rib. And I know a lot of you say, ooh, pink, but that's medium. And boys, oh boys, does it ever taste good. Mm. Anyways, thanks for watching. And until next time, keep cooking.